Hello, beautiful people. The beauty of PR checking in and welcome to Skin Saturday. <laughs> I'm so excited to do this Skin Saturday for you guys because you get to see what products I use on my face. But first, make sure y'all like and make sure y'all subscribe and make sure y'all leave me a comment to let me know what else you want to see as far as skin is concerned. But anyway. Saturdays are my days that I show you guys um, anything skin related, whether I go get a facial or what products I'm using on my face or how I'm overcoming acne. Because look, I done came a long way. I got a few blemishes. If you got any tricks, please drop them in the comments because I will love, 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 love to hear from you. Welcome to Skin Saturday. Let's get straight into it. First, I'm going to show you guys my skincare routine. Cotton Rail, alcohol, clean and clear and under control. <laughs> and then we go in with the sea breeze. You see I use the yellow one. Um, that blue one is for wussies. And then speaking of the blue one, I use this red dog cream for my face every day. And this is how I stay flawless behind the camera. Let's get right into it. First, for sure, you're gonna need two cotton rounds. And you see like there's like two different sides, like hold on, here I go being a YouTuber. There's like two different sides. I'm really trying to show y'all the texture, texture. There's two different sides. So I use the side that's like smooth. Um, and the first thing I do is I put alcohol. I put alcohol on a cotton swab. I didn't wear no makeup yesterday. So I put alcohol on a cotton swab. I usually put everything in like um, a Venn diagram type. <laughs> I put like three um, squirts on there or whatever you want to call it squirter and then I just clean and I like to go in circles first thing I do is work my cheek areas because those are my problem areas and then I'll go in on my forehead my forehead really isn't that big of a problem area for me my nose sometimes is though so I'm using alcohol because I do want to strip all those oils from my face first before I clean it and kind of just like remove all that excess dirt that just lies around on your face like when you're sleeping and throughout the day. So the first thing I want to do is clean the area. I look at my face as like an open wound. So the first thing I want to do is I want to clean the area before I apply any products. Okay. Boom. Look, before. <laughs> and I'm happy about this dirt, okay? Because had I not done this, I would not have gotten this off. And then what I do is I go ahead. Today is not in an exfoliating day. I'll have the next Saturday. I will make a video where I exfoliate my skin so you guys can see what products I use, of course, and what brushes and all that good stuff. But anyways, for today, we're going to use Clean and Clear Morning Burst. Y'all, I love the scent of this, and I love how light it is because I have sensitive skin, and my skin just breaks out to any and everything. So I normally just, like, put... I take two fingers. I ain't trying to be cute. Put it on one. Put it on two. So... One, two, because I'm greedy. Boom, 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 boom. And then I normally just like share with the other one and then I just get my fingertips and I go in a circular motion again, motion again, just like I did with the alcohol swab. And I just do this to massage it all in. So anyways, what products are y'all using? How's y'all skin been during quarantine? Is my face the only face that breaks out from wearing those stupid masks? Like, please let me know because I 
that is a struggle point for me and i really don't appreciate that like i hate when i'm having like a good skin day and then y'all know how i have to like still kind of like be on the scene so wearing that mask and then sometimes like sweating and then it's just like ugh, there's just so much bacteria and stuff just touching my face that i really just like I'm a germaphobe that it freaks me out so i cannot wait until this whole mask thing is lifted speaking of lifted let's wash this face so i like to wash my face on with hot water because let me take a drain y'all i really don't feel like i'm clean unless i use hot water Gotta get the eye area, and then of course, this side. Woo! Burn! Oh my god! Woo! It's calm. Then, then. Okay, so I normally like a little dance. <laughs> Not. <laughs> but I normally do have like some um I normally have like Sarah Jakes on right now, y'all, because I love me some Sarah Jakes Roberts. Like I tune in to sis. I tune it, sis. We are here. If you don't speak my life, yes, child. Now look. <sighs> One day I will be able to give you a hug after COVID. Just so I can feel that energy because I be feeling you. Anyway, speaking of feeling, let's put the toner on our face. Take your second cotton round and then apply your sea breeze on there, which is an astringent. Let me read the details for y'all. It's an it's an astringent and it deep cleans with a tingle refreshing feeling. But anyway, so yes, after that, you take your um, sea breeze and then you go ahead and just like clean your face. And what this does is this gets rid of any other excess dirt that is on your face that your face um, scrub or face wash didn't get um, or the alcohol before. And that's really important because you don't want to go apply like moisturizers or oils, whatever you use for your face, like to condense moisturize throughout the day. You don't want to put, you don't want to coat that you don't want to coat the dirt so get rid of the dirt so for, to your best ability and as clean as you can get the cotton swab like right now mine is like damn near like pearly white which is good so that mean that's a good sign what's that a sign for <laughs> i'm glad you asked <laughs> let's seal this bad boy <laughs> So, yeah, we go ahead and we put our retinol cream on. Um, and I love this retinol cream um, because, one, it's nice and light. And it also has SPF in it. So, it's really good, like, when I go out, like, in the sun. But you're still also recommended to put SPF on, period. So, I love putting this on my fa um, my face. It's by uh, Nature Well. <laughs> Look, y'all need to tap in with your girl because, look, I'm hosting Skin Saturday and I'm talking about your product and I've been using this for a very long time. However, I think this is about like $25, like $26 on Amazon. I love that it has the pump. I had to take mine off, y'all, because, look, I'm getting down to the, the last of it and uh, the pump doesn't want to pump. So... Um, it's kind of like unfair. I guess that's not a good way to show y'all how much I use. I don't use a lot. Use like this much. <laughs> use like this much. I rub it between my fingers and then I pat it in my areas in my, what y'all call this? A T-zone. And definitely under my eyes. And then I just begin to pat all over until it's everywhere. Can't forget about that. I just pat, 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 pat. pat. 
and right now i have on this like little like turban thing because i normally i don't like um having my hair out when i wash my face because since i am like supernatural um i have a lot of oils in my hair and um, a lot of like gel and other products on my hair from my styles that i wear and putting water on my face like i need a boundary line you know um i need a red turban or something y'all because this one is kind of play y'all see i got one missing but anyways shout out to my mama because she gave this to me and um and that's it for skin saturday thank y'all so much for tuning in i showed you guys the products that i use every day to accomplish um soft and like smooth skin um these are very 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 economically friendly you can find all these products at your local drugstore thank you guys for tuning in to today's episode of skincare saturday i am the beauty of PR. You have been watching me this far. Make sure you like and subscribe and comment below y'all. Comment. Let me know how y'all feel. Like what's your skincare routine looking like? Do you have one? Uh, do you like the products that I use or what else would you recommend? Um, or even if you have your own products, send them my way. I would love to include them on one of my episodes of skin skin Saturday. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at the.beauty.ofpr. I will be wearing red, duh. <laughs> and if you want to inquire about how I can help make your brand beautiful, make sure you log on to www.thebeautyofpr.com. I'm Kay, the Beauty of PR, and I'm signing out.